up guys Anthony come back at you here in the video and it's got a hopefully quick video today um, just got some stuff to show that I like to show uh, really quickly before I move back into college um, classes start on Monday I move back in on Sunday um, which is also my grandfather's birthday so doing some stuff with him clean shave new haircut um, updates not in the best of moods unfortunately bad things keep happening um, nothing to do with my car this time but unfortunately um, Last week, one of my friends was killed in a car accident. Um, him and another kid um, coming home ended up hitting another vehicle. Um, still, uh, still don't know like the drinking was involved, but uh, vehicle flipped over. Uh, neither of them were wearing their seatbelts, unfortunately, and uh, both of them were killed. Uh, the driver, who I I vaguely knew him, I want to say. Um, was dead at the scene uh, my friend Travis uh, was in critical condition and uh, passed away later that night uh, at the hospital um, so been busy with that um, but I do have some stuff to show because I like to sort the stuff out because I don't know when I'm gonna be able to make a video again um, I'm gonna be as busy. I have like maybe like a couple small things coming, but nothing major. So I just want to kind of get this out of the way. I also have some stuff to sell. Uh, I just posted up on the Facebook um, random group my 2014 Topps Chrome Rob Gronkowski Complete Rainbow. If you're interested in that, um, go check that out. I also have the um, for sale um, a lot of Garoppolo's. Got the base refractor, X Fractor. Uh, blue wave and green I could do for like 10 shipped I have the complete Storm Johnson rainbow if there's any Jaguars fans out there um, is the complete uh, complete rainbow uh, base through purple could do like 25 shipped on that uh, I have the Revis rainbow minus the purple uh, base through red um, I don't have the purple that's the only one that I'm missing uh, I could do like 25 shipped on that um, and then I have uh, just got this in. I didn't plan on buying this, but I got it for such a good deal, and I know I can make money on it. Uh, the Red Refractor at Tom Brady. Um, created a BGS Raw 9.5. Um, so I'll throw that into the Brady's that I have already, um, including a bunch of the unnumbered, but then I got the camo pink and gold to 50. Um, the last raw red, the last red raw bleh, that sold sold for 70 bucks. And the last gold I think sold for, one sold for like 34, one sold for 45. I'd be looking at like 80 bucks for everything. So then it's like, I mean, a raw went for 70. So this should definitely fetch 80 alone. So you're getting a freaking gold refractor for free. Um, but yeah, looking to pretty much move all that. I have to buy new lacrosse gear, um, which is not cheap. And unfortunately, um, with expenses right now, just can't afford it, so I'll have to sell some stuff. Um, but I've been selling off a lot of stuff. I dropped my 2006 exquisite debut signature set mainly because, like I said, I need the money. Um, been selling off most of my collection. Um, the only thing I have left is Blake Bortles, Shabazz Napier, and uh, the Legend PC that I've started. Um, but, anyways, uh, just unfortunately, I need to make some purchases. And uh, I'm still working, but unfortunately, hour I'll be working less, obviously, because I'm back in school. Um, but anyways, let's get to the mail. Uh, a couple extras that got thrown into a deal. Got a Marcus Camby insert and then a rookie card of Ray Allen. So nice looking cards. Probably throw those into the collection. Just love collecting old 90s inserts. Um, for the Julian Edelman collection, which I'd like to start up again, I'm keeping his uh, 2014 rainbow, uh, top scrum rainbow that I have completed. And then I'm going to be looking for new stuff of him. I just miss collecting a Patriot. Um, picked up the National Treasures base, uh, number 299. And the Immaculate Base number 299. Um, for Shabazz Napier, I got for the Prism Rainbow at the base, the orange die cut, which is number 139. The blue, numbered out of 49. And then for the Select Rainbow, I got the blue and the red to 249 and to 149. Uh, from SPX, Number two, 499, the standard jersey autograph. From select, number two, 199, jersey autograph. Uh, number two, 199, the gold scripts autograph, gold standard. 
from Spectra number two, 125, the base Jersey Auto. For the um, RPA set, the blue RPA, number 299. Uh, next up for the Prism uh, Autograph Rainbow, number 2, 149, the red. And then a card that popped up on a Buy It Now or Best Offer for significantly less than what I would have been willing to pay if it had popped up on auction. I submitted it like I had an offer, looked back about like 10 minutes later and there were two other watchers and just said screw it and just bought it now. I didn't want to risk losing it out on it because it was a great price uh, for the Prism Rainbow, the gold number to 10. So the only one I'm missing for this rainbow is the purple Pulsar number to 49. So if you know where that is or have it, let me know. Uh, from Immaculate uh, number to 20, the Jumbo Patch. This card took me so long to find. I've lost out on so many of them. Wish I could have gotten a better patch, but I'd rather just get the card out of the way and hopefully down there would upgrade it. Uh, from And then also from Immaculate, the Shadow Box Signatures autograph number to 60. And lastly, the Shabazz, last Shabazz Navy card that I picked up, a card that I felt like I got for just absolute steal, picked up for seven bucks. Um, from Preferred, the Prime Patch Booklet number 25. Seven bucks, can't complain. And lastly, I got one pickup for the Legends PC. Um, basically, when I say Legends, is because I want to do both future Hall of Fame and Hall of Fame, and not only just sports legends, but I want to do like celebrities that have cards as well. And um, anyways, just keeping it extremely open. Uh, wanted this guy's autograph. Um, I was this is one guy that I wanted um, to have in the collection. Not my favorite player, but hands down, probably the greatest regular season quarterback of all time. Can't really tell that say the say that about his uh postseason um but anyways um when it came to this guy and another guy's uh autographs i wanted both their autographs and i chose i'm being very particular about which cards i go after specifically bold on card autographs old upper deck products game use making sure it was game use memorabilia with the better coas on the back if i get game used this and that um and i decided for this player and as well as another player that i wanted either one of their autographs from this set and another set and basically how that worked was whichever one I got first I'd get the the other player from the other set so if you know what I mean because they were both in these sets um, but anyways um, from 2008 Upper Deck Ultimate Collection the dual jersey autograph number 15 BGS 9 with a 10 autograph of Peyton Manning so him and Aaron Rodgers were both in this set, and these do not pop up very often. Um, and then they're both in the 2008 Exquisite Legendary Signatures set. Um, so I said, whichever one pops up first, I'll get, and then I'll get the other one of the other players. So this one popped up first, popped up during the three times. Well, the guy had listed at a really high buy it now, and then every single time it didn't sell, he just lowered it, lowered it, lowered it, until he lowered it to a price where I could pay. And then it was also during the triple eBay Bucks deal, so I ended up even getting more money so I felt like I got this at a great price super nice autograph one of my favorite sets so guys that's it um I kind of just like flew through that stuff just like I said I'm just really not in the mood to make a video um, with everything that's going on right now um but I kind of had to also wanted to give you guys update where where I'm at I'm going back to school um uh still like I said, I'm going to be playing soccer, playing lacrosse, working out. Um, going to be very busy. Classes, working, student teaching. So it's going to be a busy semester. Um, so yeah, that's what's been going on. If you can help me out, make some purchases. Um, like I said, one's up on the random group as we speak. Um, I'm going to hopefully sell tonight so I can order my new helmet. i got to buy a new stick. i got to buy new gloves. Uh, got it by new shoulder pads because when it comes to games we have our game equipment um, which is like all like the official gear that the school provides for us to use during the games because they want everybody to look the same obviously um, but during practices we use practice gear which we have to provide our own um, and unfortunately uh, mine 
gear is pretty shot. So if I can get some new gear, uh, yeah. But anyways, I'm rambling over 10 minutes. Thanks for watching.